What up y'all, how's it going? Ben Dean here. It's about 5.15 a.m. and I'm with my girlfriend, she's over there and we're waiting at the bus stop and we're about to head to the airport and head over to Boracay in the Philippines. So, pretty excited. I uh, didn't get much sleep, got about an hour of sleep, but that's more than I thought I would actually. Uh, I didn't think I'd sleep at all, so that's good. Uh, we have a pretty long day ahead of us. We have to take this bus to the airport, uh, then take our flight, which is about, I think about four hours, and then we have to get on another bus, and then take a boat to the island, and then take another bus to the hotel, I think. So yeah, it's gonna be pretty busy, but um, I'll show you guys uh, you know, what's going on along the way, so stay tuned. <laughs> All right, so now we're gonna take this boat to the island, so that should be fun. We finally made it to our hotel. Uh, here it is. It's kind of like, they call it a boutique hotel. It seems pretty nice. It's right by the ocean. The beach is like literally 30 seconds away, I think. Um, no view, unfortunately, and it is raining. So, uh, I don't know, hopefully it will stop raining soon, but they gave us a, a free beer and this like necklace thing. But I thought I would show you the room real quick. So, let's go. Pretty decent room, in my opinion. Uh, let's see. <coughs> Got a nice bed over here. TV. And bathroom. Standard bathroom. But it's nice. So yeah, uh, I'm not sure what we're gonna do right now. I think we're going to like, I don't know. I wanted to check out the beach, but it's raining. So I'm not really sure about that. Um, I guess we're gonna, it's like 5.15 right now. So we're kind of hungry. Probably get something to eat. I came to this like restaurant slash uh, bar slash pub type place to get some dinner and drinks and here's what I got served here. This is a big, really big burger. I don't know if you can tell how big this is, but it's like really big burger. Uh, we got a Long Island iced tea and some beers and it's pretty cheap. So we're like right across from the beach. It's like raining pretty hard and uh, the, the wind is like really crazy right now, but uh, it's still a really nice atmosphere, I feel like. Yeah. And uh, yeah, I, I did hop in the water for a little bit. I didn't film it, but hopefully over the next couple of days, I'll get to film like some of that. But anyway, for now, we're just gonna eat and drink, and then maybe go to a club. You go to Moku Moa Cup. Oh, 
I'm starting to think that Boracay is just always raining. So we woke up and it was kind of like, looked like it was gonna rain. And now it's just like coming down really crazy. But anyway, we came down to the, uh, the hotel restaurant. We got this pizza and some pasta and a beer, of course. And then, I don't know, just gonna eat. Hopefully it'll stop raining so we can jump in the, uh, in the water for a while. I'm not sure if you guys can hear me at all because it's super windy, but uh, I just wanted to show you the hotel real quick. And so here's our hotel, it's called Vila, Vila. And then here's the beach. So it's like pretty much right on the beach. And it's really nice because like our room's like 30 seconds away. We can just go out and go back if we want. And uh, I figured I might as well show you what it looks like. We're on our way to this place called Spider House. It's like this restaurant. Um, it's like right on the water, I think. I don't know. We saw some stuff on it online. Anyway, we are walking there right now and stopped by this place, which is like a shopping area. It's called D Mall, and it's got a lot of shops, um, touristy stuff, restaurants, coffee shops, or juice shops, stuff like that. I would say it's like um, if you know Myeongdong in Seoul, it's kind of like the same kind of kind of thing. So we got kind of lost, came back to the road, and uh, decided to just ask this guy to take us there. Was, these are like really popular. Basically, it's like the thing right in front of us. It's like a motorcycle with a sidecar attached to it. And so we made it to Spider House, this crazy restaurant. It's like literally, it's like right on the water here. And it's like a crazy. Tropical vibe here. They have like a lot of indoor spaces and I think they have outdoor seating as well but it was raining and like the waves here are pretty crazy. Let me show you. Check this out. Pretty cool. So they came to this hookah place, it's right by the beach, which is over there. But they're already packing up for the night, it looks like. There's nobody else here, which is pretty nice. Um, but also, we ran out of money. We left all our other cash at home, so... I guess we're just gonna, you know, chill here for now, and then go back to the hotel and call it a night as well, so... Yeah, I guess I'll see you guys tomorrow. First meal of the day, we came to this chicken place. Uh, I think it's pretty popular. I've seen a lot of them here. Uh, this is what I got. I just asked for the most popular thing on the menu. He just gave me this uh, chicken. Uh, SJ got some chicken too. And it's right on the beach, which is nice. I guess all of the, uh, the restaurants and bars here are right on the beach, but let me taste this real quick. Mm.
I got to our second hotel and it's a really big suite actually. It's like a, an apartment. So in here we have like a living room, little like outside area, dining room, and a kitchen as well, big old kitchen. And uh, yeah, this place is like a golf resort kind of place. Uh, there's it's on the other side of the island and there's a like a private beach, it's a, and there's like four swimming pools around here, so it's like a huge kind of resort. Here's the bedroom, there's a bathroom in here, and there's actually two bathrooms, one over there as well. So yeah, it's pretty cool right now. It's been raining all day, so I'm not sure exactly what we're gonna do, but I think we're just going to maybe check out the private beach and maybe hop in the pool. Here is the private beach at the second hotel. It is raining, but as you can see, the water is a lot more calm and it's really warm actually. So, Also, there's not really many people here at all, which is really nice. We did a little bit of snorkeling. I think we're gonna play with that beach ball a little bit. So this pool is pretty cool too. I don't know if you can see, but it's pretty big and there's absolutely nobody here except SJ. Uh, right by the beach over there too. So I came here for dinner. I asked this random guy on the street for a suggestion and he told us to come here. So it's got some appetizers, got some uh, fried calamari here. We also got some pizza and pasta coming out. All right, so our last dinner in Borca. Uh, we got some barbecue chicken, and then we got some like fried pork, or not fried pork, it's like roasted pork, but the skin is really crispy. I think it's called um, lechon. Here they call it uh, crisp chon, but I think it's kind of the same thing. I'm not really sure actually, but it's really good. Um, we have to go back to the hotel pretty soon, so we're just gonna eat here and then head back. And you know, going back <clears throat> be the same process, so I probably won't film anymore. But I'll see you back in Seoul. So we're at the uh, the airport, waiting to go back to Korea. And I just thought I'd, I'd show you like what it's going on here, because there's a ton of people. It's a very small airport. <laughs> I think they have a, a lack of seats going on here. <laughs> Alright, so just got back to Seoul. Picked up Peji over here. Peji! Peji, say hi! Uh, yeah, he was uh, staying at a vet while we were gone because it didn't really work out for any one of our friends to come and watch him or anything. So he was staying at a vet. He really didn't like it. <laughs> Uh, but he's fine now. It's like 11, 12 p.m. Well, in the afternoon, and he's super tired. So I think I'm going to sleep all day. And I don't know. My my time is schedule is all messed up right now. 
But yeah, uh, it was really fun. I'll probably talk about more about the vacation in the mukbang or something. And I'll have this vlog, so hopefully I can edit that soon. Anyway, I'm going to take a nap. Peace.